Good morning. Welcome to the Mark Martin Auto Showcase show. Thanks for watching. We appreciate it. I wish I'd brought my basketball. It's been March Madness. We've been watching a lot of basketball, and there's still basketball to go. Great time of the year. Sun's shattered. The rain's gone. The cold weather's gone. Business is here. Time to do business. If you're looking for a car, whether it be new or used, don't turn channels. Don't turn your channels. Listen to me. Let me tell you something. A lot of you have been watching the show. I've had a lot of people say something about it, and I've even had a lot of people doing business with us. But if it's your first time to watch a show, for the next 30 minutes, sit back, get yourself a cup of coffee. Yeah, I'm talking to you. I want to do car business with you the right way and the only way, okay? Let me tell you this. We're at Mark Martin Ford today, which is located right here in Southside. And I always tell you right next door, we got Mark Martin Kia. We got Mark Martin Chevrolet in Melbourne, which is 35 mile. We got Mark Martin Chevrolet Buick GMC, which is in Ash Flat, which is 47 mile. So if you're in North Central Arkansas or anywhere in the sound of my voice, we can take care of your automotive needs, okay? Number one, no Mickey Mouse. You go to Disney World for Mickey Mouse. No Mickey Mouse uh, dealings here. All straightforward, straight shooting. We'll show you numbers. We're gonna do what's right. I always preach to you. I get fighting mad when I'm trying to watch these basketball games, these car commercials. Now they got some double down your down payment. And there's a lot of little print. I told my wife, TiVo that. I don't have a clue how to TiVo. I'm old school and I don't want to learn. I TiVo it. I get my magnifying glass. I walk up to my TV because I can't even read it. And they're going to double your down payment if you pay when to sticker. How about that? They'll double your down payment if you pay with it. Well, yeah, so your $1,000 car they're going to give you two grand for. Have you ever heard of anything like it? They're giving you a 1000 off a window stick. Come on, guys. I'm sick of Mickey Mouse advertising. Mickey Mouse for Disney World. Straight shooters, that's what we're all about right here at Mark Martin. I'm not going to blow smoke and mirrors. I'm not going to deceive you. Car dealers want one thing, okay? We want the opportunity. I always tell you this. We want the opportunity. We just want you to come onto our lot. But you'll never, ever, ever, as long as I'm living, have a Mark Martin dealership with ads advertised that can't be done. They've got all these these cars by one thirty nine a month, one twenty nine a month. Number one, and that's print that you can't see that goes so fast. Or those radio commercials, you even hear those commercials at the end of them. They got that disclaimer. They got talk to you. You can't understand what they're saying. But they have to do it to get away with the FCC. They got to be legal. But they're telling you with twenty five hundred dollars down or two thousand dollars down that you ain't got. But here's what those dealerships are all about, okay? 100 people pulling there. Let's go down to 10. 10 people pulling that lot. Five of them are going to turn around mad because they can't buy it for that. They're going to say, doggone it. Three of the other five are going to sit there and work a deal and say, well, honey, we're already here. Let's go ahead and buy a car. So they sold three out of 10. They're tickled to death with those bogus ads. It's called just like this. It's that time of the year we start fishing, hook, line, and sinker, and they got you reeled in, and they pulled you into their store. That's what they're trying to do is reel you into their store. I'll never, never reel you in that way. The only way I'm going to reel you in is straightforward, straight business, straight shooter, okay? So I stress that, and I promise that that's the way it's going to be. No Mickey Mouse tactics. The next thing I'm going to tell you where I'm going to win, you think, man, this guy's a winner. Yeah, you're talking to the winner. The next way I'm going to win is none of those ads. I'll give you more if you trade. They've got all these guys that they've hired, and you'll see them working at one dealership. Six months later, they'll be working. I go to the auctions all the time. They got to change shirts out. I don't know how they afford their wardrobes because they're not putting up numbers. They're not doing what the boss wants them. They've got to get a book out and look. Here's what happens. We all pay the same for new cars, regardless. I don't care. You go to Memphis, you go to Little Rock, you go to St. Louis. Oh, they're a bigger dealership. We all pay the same. That's Mickey Mouse, okay? Back on the Mickey Mouse. It all comes down to what you're getting for your trade. Those guys all use what's called a black book, okay? Now, before you're going to come to my dealership, you're going to get on Kelly Blue Book and see what Kelly says it's worth. Some of you's going to get on NADA and see what they say it's worth. I'm going to get on the market and tell you what it's worth, okay? And what I tell you is real money, no smoke and mirrors. We'll give you that for your car. These other guys are going to look at black book, go to average and deduct and add, subtract. Oh, this is what your car... We're not about that. We're about telling you what your car's worth. I promise you this. I'm going to win every time. Every once in a while, I'll get somebody comes in. Well, Kelly said this. I always tell them, I don't have a problem with that. Call Kelly, sell it to Kelly, and then come buy my car cheaper. But the problem is, you can't get a hold of Kelly. That's a national research company that started that that's making millions talking about Kelly, and there's really no Kelly. 
okay? There's a real Mooney, and he's right here, and he's at every dealership by a phone call away, and I'll give you appraisal on your car just like that. We ain't got to call people. We ain't got to get a wholesaler in here. We ain't got to run it up down the road. We're going to do business with you, okay? Been doing this for 38 years. I understand. I probably, that just shocked a lot of you. You said, man, he ain't but about 38. Well, thank you for that. But I've been doing this for 38 years. I know what they're worth. I'm on the money. Just want the opportunity to do business with you. Everything going to be, nobody likes buying cars, okay? First experience they had, they always think it's bad. They come in here, it takes a long time. They think they're going to get cheated. They think we're all bad guy. I promise you, there's good people in this business. I hire them. If they're bad, I get rid of them. I try to hire good people. I try to keep good people. We work, strive at that. I hire people all the time that know zero about the bar, car business, but they're good people. I said, I'll teach you the car business if you just go to work for me. Try to take care of you. The main thing I tell you, before the sale, during the sale, and after the sale. We're not going to forget you after you sell you. We're going to, if you have a problem, we're going to come back. I tell my people all the time, if you see Miss Smith pull in here and she just bought three weeks ago, don't run, hide, say, what's Miss Smith on now? Go out there and confront her. Miss Smith, how can I help you? What's your problem? These are man-made products. Things are going to happen to them. Okay? So if something happens to a car, we're going to take care of it. Whatever we got to do, we want to make your experience a right buying car experience. We want everything to go well from start to finish until it's time to trade it again. Okay? So all I'm asking for is the opportunity. If you go to markmartinautomotive.com, we keep approximately 150 pre-owned right here at all times at the Ford store. We keep around 100 at Melbourne store and we keep 100 at Ash Flat store. So we keep 350 pre-owned cars in stock at all times. So regardless of what you're looking for, any make, any brand, we've probably got it. If we don't have it, we'll get it. No, we're not those internet dealers. I've had some of them get on the internet and shop because they call me and say, Money, will you sell me this car? You know, we're not that way. I'm not scared. I'll buy all kinds of cars, all makes, all models. So we carry every kind of brand. We, we keep it. Most of the time, if we ain't got it, you don't need it, okay? You need to switch. But we'll accommodate you with whatever you're looking for. We're going to help you. And I want to stress to you, we'll trade for anything, okay? We're not scared. If you watched this show, it wasn't long ago. I had a saddle on here. And I met my maker, I thought, because I gave the guy maybe a little too much. And I kept that saddle for about two months. But I knew sooner or later the old right cowboy would come in here. He'd come riding up on a bareback horse, and he was all hurting and sore. And I said, I can fix your problem. I got a saddle. And he left out here grinning like a possum with a cup of coffee in one hand and a new saddle in the other hanging on. So whatever you got, I'm going to take care of you. Tell you what we're going to do. Let's preview some of our trade-ins right now. All right, now I just told you about my saddle. And you, if you watched the show, you've seen that saddle. And you know I trade for anything. And look what we just traded for. We just traded for this. We haven't even washed it. That ain't been through the shop. This is how we traded for it. This is a 2012 Mahindra 4025, 4025, okay? With a box blade on the black. It's brand new. And you can tell that I don't have anybody that can operate it. Because most tractor operators are not with double knit pants on, with a dress shirt on, trying to sell cars. Okay, it took him all he could do to get it up here. But this is a 2012 Mahindra, and I've done a little research, okay? This is the largest tractor manufacturer in the world. Research me and see if I'm right. I'll say that again. The largest manufacturer of tractors in the world is Mahindra brand tractors. Let me tell you what I traded for right here. This is a 2012 that is literally brand new. It don't have, it ain't been used none with a brand new little box blade. We still got the papers hanging on the box blade. I'll say this tractor and box blade and driver. I'll let you take him home for 24 hours worth of experience for $99.95. Under $10,000. Here's the deal of the day right here. I was just kidding. You won't have to go run it. That scared him to death. He thought he'd go out to Rex and go physically work for a day. I'm going to let him stay here and sell cars. We'll help you load it. But I'm going to say this 2012 Mahindra 4025 with box blade, the whole package for $99.95. I'm telling you, this is the deal of the day. You need to come look at this tractor if you're a tractor man. If you need to work around your yard or something, this little old tractor is brand new. We're going to let him go because it's a little bit loud. But I'm going to tell you something. Nice little old diesel tractor for $99.95. You, you can tell he's a little bit of a rookie. He kind of jerked it a little bit. but. Hey, that's a super nice tractor, and I just traded for it, and I know it won't last. But let me tell you what this truck is. This is a local one-owner trade, okay? It's a 14-model Lariat, 
with the pearl white paint with tan interior with all the equipment, 30,000 mile. This truck is literally just like brand new. Guy trades every year. This is a 14 model Larrett for $35,995. Okay? $35,995. You're going to save you about 10 grand from a new one, about $10,000 from a new one. Yes, the 15 is a new body style, but they don't have any rebates yet. There's a $1,000 rebate on a new one. They're up there at $45,000, grand. So right here, if you're looking for a crew cab four-wheel drive at $10,000 cheaper than a new one, I got it right here. One owner truck. It's got bed liner, got a brand new set of tires, running boards, center shift console, all the equipment, 30,000 miles for $35,995. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, that's a super, super nice truck. And it's got a Laird, it's got a spray-in bed liner, it's got all the equipment on it. Now, if you're not interested in a Laird, but you need a crew cab truck and you're looking for something a little less money, don't want to spend that much money, I got a 13 model XLT with the EcoBoost in it, crew cab, four-wheel drive, okay? This is a 13 model EcoBoost engine, XLT, it's got the chrome package on it, it's got the chrome wheels, it's got the hard bed cover on it, it's got the chrome steps on it, chrome bumpers, Four-wheel drive, got all the equipment on it. I'll say this truck for $28,995. $28,995 for a 13 model crew cab XLT four-wheel drive. Now, number one, compare apples for apples, compare prices. You're gonna like the price when you check around. Number two, bring your trade in. I'll give you more if you trade. I just need the opportunity. Give me the opportunity. This is a beautiful candy apple red, gray interior, Got the super engine and got the little eco boost that everybody loves. That's getting anywhere from 17 to 22 miles per gallon. I know that's five different, but everybody drives different. I get 16, 17 because I run flat on the floor, okay? If you drive right, you're going to get 19 to 21. So it depends on how you drive. Hard bed cover, super nice truck. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, that's a good looking truck for $28,995. It's a Razorback Red. Looks just like an Arkansas Razorback ring. I'll tell you, here's a rig we sold brand new that we just traded for. It's a 2011 Expedition, hard loaded. This is a limited, okay? It's going to be a limited, which means it's got the power boards. When you open the door, the boards fall out. Got the chrome 20s, sunroof, navigation, quad seating, four-wheel drive, you name it. It's got it hard, hard loaded. Are you ready? $29,995. $29,995 for a 2011 limited expedition I dare to compare. You're going to find them around. Number one, you're not going to find many. They're hard to find. But number two, when you find them, they're going to be 33000 34000 The next thing is when they throw your trade in there, you're going to be driving about a 04 or 05 model. They're going to try to steal it. Give me the opportunity. That's all I'm asking for. Local one owner. We sold it new. We know everything about it. Super, super nice rig. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, that's a super nice rig, hard, hard loaded for 29 9.95. Okay, we had a couple big rigs. Maybe that's too big, but you need summer coming on. You need to haul people. Look here, what we got. 2014. We always carry two, three, four, five, six caravans at every store. People love them. That kind of was the hottest thing going. Then little SUVs took over. Now people are going back to vans because they need that room. They need that cargo space. They need that luggage space. They need to haul people. Right here is a 14 model. Dodge Caravan SXT package. We're not talking about a base rig with hubcaps. This rig has got wheels on it. That's what I always tell you. Make sure that we compare apples for apples if you try to beat me on my pricing. Okay? Make sure you try to beat me apples for apples. What I mean by that, you're going to find some of these SE rental rigs with hubcaps on them. That's going to be cheaper. But that's not what I'm telling you about today. I'm telling you about a 14 model that's still got teen miles on it. It's got 19,000 miles on it. It's got quad seating, not bench, quad seating with the third row, with the hard wheels, not with the cheap plastic hubcaps. I'll say this 14 model with teen miles on it for $19,995. Under $20,000 for a current year model, 2014, $19,995. It's a Peladobe Gold with tan interior. It's a beautiful rig. Springs here, spring sprung. It's time to go to those baseball games. Here's the vehicle to do it in, $19,995. We're gonna move on, but that's a super, super nice rig for under 20 grand. And like I told you, not a base rig, not a hubcap rig. Same way with this little rig. This is gonna be a 2012 Murano, but here's the kicker. We just come out of all that snow and ice, all wheel drive. A lot of you got stuck, couldn't get around. You're saying, I'm trading for a four wheel drive or an all wheel drive. Well, here it is. 
This is going to be a 2012 Nissan Murano all-wheel drive, okay, for $19,995. Under 20 grand. It's a beautiful blue, tan interior. You see a lot of these in silver and white and black. Kind of rare to see this blue color. It's kind of different. When you pull up, you don't want to be the same kind. So you've got you something different here. It's a 2012 Murano all-wheel drive for $19,995. And I'm going to tell you something. Super, super nice rig, super clean, 40,000 mile car, very, very low miles for a 12 model. Get out and find one that's an all-wheel drive, hard to do it. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, that's a super, super nice rig for under 20 grand. Well, if you're looking for some luxury, let me tell you something. These cars right here is some of the nicest cars on the road. All I've got to get you to do is set in the seat and drive it down the road. I promise you, once you drive them. Okay, they didn't take off that good because of the name. They've made Tarses now since 1912, I believe. I'm sure you have heard of Tarses forever, and they're one of the, if not the best cars that's ever been built. They run forever. Then they went to a Ford 500 for about three or four years. Well, that never clicked because they thought the young yippies, kind of like this boy driving, these young couples, they didn't want to walk up and so say, I drive a Tars. That ain't cool. So they went to 500. Well, that didn't really go cool. So they went back to a Tars. Here's what I'm telling you. If you'll sit in one of these cars and you'll drive it, hands down, I promise you, you can't find nothing without driving. This is going to be a current year model. This is a 2015 Taurus Limited. It's hard loaded. It's a chocolate brown with black leather. It's got factory wheels on it. This car right here is just like brand new, but it's got 19,000 miles. It's already, the first guys took the licking. This is going to list for about 42, 43 grand, okay? I'm going to sell you this car for 28,995. What? 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 You thought your TV stuttered, didn't you? $28,995. One just like it new, go over here and buy you new, and you're going to spend a minimum of $34,000, $35,000. The first guy took the licking. Here's the deal of the day, and I'm telling you, all you got to do is drive one. Super, super nice car. If I get you to get in this car, go 20 miles and come back, I promise you, you're going to trade with me because, number one, I'm going to give you more of your car. Number two, you're going to love this car. It's a deep chocolate brown with black interior. It's a beautiful car. It's a current year model for $28,995. I'm going to save you about five to eight grand from a new one, and it's just like a new one. Super, super nice car. Just give me the chance. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, that is a super car, a limited package with all the bells and whistles, a super, super nice car for that kind of money. Well, let me tell you about this car. And a lot of times, let me tell you this, low mileage cars actually scare some people. Well, why'd they trade that? What's wrong with that? You know, I've got a truck here I traded for that's got 500 miles. Well, what's wrong with that? Well, I'll tell you what. They went to another town, bought it, drove it, and after they got home in it, they didn't like it. They hated it. You know what happened? They went to one of them city slickers, okay? They got one of them high-pressured salesmen that got them to sign on the line. So, then the next manager come in. Oh, look at here what we're going to do. Then the next one come in. Oh, probably throw in a couple of Sonic burgers and a Dairy Queen ice cream or something. Got them so excited that they bought that truck, and when they got home, they were about crying about it because they hated it. Okay? Here's the same type of situation right here. This is a 2015 model. Now, listen to me. This is a 2015 model Chevrolet Impala. Here's what I want to say. You'll say, well, I see new ones. Listen to me. A 2015, it is an LT and it is a six cylinder. You're going to find nine LTs and four cylinders for the same money. Okay? Dead cost, this car is going to list for $34,000. I know, I got two Chevy stores. This car is going to list for $34,000. You dealers that are watching, see if I'm talking right. It's going to list for in the 34s, give or take a couple options. Cost on it's going to be 32. dollars I'm with you right so far, aren't I? Yeah, I'm right. Then there's going to be 500 to 1000 depending on the time of the year of uh, rebate. So you're going to net net this car out at 30,000 a nickel or 31 grand. Okay? This car has 1,000 miles on it. It is literally brand new, no stories, same thing. The people bought it, they were city slick, and they didn't like the car. It's not what they went to buy. They drove to the big city. This is what they told me. We drove to the big city because we thought this cheaper. We got down there and they swarmed us just like bees do a jar of honey. You know, they just oof. And next thing they know, they drove this car home. Then they got home and they was disappointed because this is not what they went for. They come here, they had a good experience, and they traded with us. Okay? I'll sell you this car, a 15 model for $28,995. I'm going to save you $4,000. You say, well, that's not a lot for me. Listen to me. $4,000? You know what I can do with $4,000? Whoo! I can go out and eat a lot at a lot of fancy places. Okay? $4,000 is what you're saving. It has one 
thousand miles. It's literally brand new. No storage. You can call the people. I'm telling you exactly what happened. The same thing that happened to that Dodge truck. They got slitty city. They got Mickey Mouse, as I call it, because they went there and they seen all the smoke and the mirrors and the balloons was flying. Everybody was all excited, giving away free popcorn. The bounce houses was a jumping and a jive, and the circus was going on. Here come the salesmen out, and the next thing you know, boom, this is what they come home in. They got home, and they said, oh, it's not what we went for. They went for an SUV, and it's what they come in. You're looking for this. This is the deal, $28,995. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, and I'm explaining to you because I'm going to tell you this. I do get cars in here such as that that scare people sometimes. They say, well, what's wrong with that car? What happened to it? What? Nothing happened to it. People buy cars out of impulse or city slick, and that's exactly what happened. I got a Dodge truck right over there I'll show you. The people, the same thing, you can call the guy. He said, tell him to call me. There's nothing wrong with it. He said, I can tell you what happened. I got city slick, okay? Okay, let me tell you what we just traded for. A 2012 Dodge Charger with all the bells and whistles. It's a Hemi. It's an RT, the chrome wheels on it, with the spoiler, with the roof, with the leather, all the black on black, not a prettier car on the road, a 12 model charger, you listen to this, $24,995. $24,995 for a 12 charger RT with a Hemi, okay? You're looking at a 40 grand car here, new, 40 plus. All the bells and whistles, $24,995 for a triple black car, dipped in black, beautiful car, chromes on it, roof, Spoiler, leather, RT package, all the bells and whistles, everything for $24,995. And I'm going to tell you something. Shop me around and compare. You won't be able to beat me. We're going to move on with that. I'm telling you, that's a super nice car for $24,995. Well, let me tell you what this little car we just traded for. And you see these cars all the time. This is something else you're going to have to compare apples for apples. This is going to be a 2012 Nissan Altima, okay? You'll say, well, I see Altimas. There's base ones, there's rental rigs. This is going to be an SL. What I mean by that, it's going to have alloy wheels on it. It's going to have a roof. It's going to have leather. It's going to be a loaded up car. We just traded for this. This is going to be a 12 model for $16,995. $16,995, and yes, you can find cheaper Altimas, but compare apples for apples. Make sure it's wheel car, leather car, roof car, and SL car, okay? This car's got all the equipment on it, got a great story. It's got 41,000 miles, 41,000 miles on a 2012 model. Okay, I got 13s and 14s with more miles than that. This car's not even broke in. Burgundy car with tan interior for $16,995. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, that's a super nice car, great payment car, great fuel mileage, and a great little car. Them cars run forever. Good car. Let me tell you, we just traded for this little car. If you're a hot rodder, this is a hot rodder car right here. This is a 14 model Focus ST. We got a professional driver here. He's wanting to drive a hot rod and pop the clutch, okay? This is a 14 model Focus ST. ST package. This little car is 30 grand new. You say, what? People that buy them know what this is. It's got the wheels on it, hatchback with a spoiler. It's a $30,000 car. This car only has 9,000 miles on it, okay? We sold it brand new. We just traded back for it. 9,000 miles on this car for $19,995. 19995 It's going to list for 30. You can buy it new for about 25. I'm going to save you another five. It's only 19995 and it's an ST package. It's a little old hot rod with that six speed in it. Super, super nice little old car. We're going to move on, but I'm telling you, super nice car for 19995 Well, let me tell you, here, I got a little 14 Rio here, and actually, Reed, I showed, we sold a million of these. Maybe not a million, maybe 700,000, but we've sold a buku of them because they're great little cars. People come back, trade them, and get another one. This is going to be a 14 model with 20 on it. It's only got 20,000 miles. I'll sell you this car for $13,995. $13,995, and I'm looking. I got another silver one. I got a maroon one. I got a blue one. I, I got three or four of these right here just in stock right now. We keep these cars because we sold so many of them, so now we're trading back for so many of them. $13,995. Super, super nice little car. It's not a base car. You're going to see some new ones advertised. Cheap. Roll up windows again. That's what they advertise. That's how they deceive you. That's how they get you to come. I'm not going to do it. Bring your old trade in. I promise you they're going to be offering you $1,500 for that old car that I'm going to give you $3,500 for. Okay? So all I'm asking for is the opportunity. We're going to move on, but I'm just telling you, that little old car right there is a super nice car. 
and I got four or five of those in stock. That's all the cars I'm going to show you today, and we're just going to explain to you how bad I want you to listen to me on the car business because, number one, I'm going to take care of you before the sale, during the sale, and after the sale, okay? We're not going to forget you. We want your business forever. I'm not talking to everybody. We can't afford everybody's business. We're not that big of a dealership. I just want yours. I'm looking, to, yeah, what? Well, yeah, you're who I'm talking to. I want your business. I'm asking you for your business. I'm telling you this, number one, you won't get no kind of Mickey Mouse treatment here. We're going to treat you with respect and treat you right. We're not going to blow up, you know, I have got rid of people that work at other places now. We'll have 13,000, 13,995, here go ask them 18 now. Oh, they got a sale today just to blow smoke and mirrors. We don't, we don't do that, okay? It all comes down to the bottom line, the difference in what you're getting for your car, and that's where they're hoodooing you, and that's where I'm going to win if I get the opportunity. I will give you more for your car. We don't use Kelly Blue Book. We don't use NADA. We don't use Black Book. We go off the market. We know what we can do with your car. We've got outlets. We send cars everywhere, okay? We've got a truck loading right now heading to Panama City. We've got another one to be here tomorrow loading going to Brownsville, Texas. That We've sold to dealers that we know what to put more in that car because we know where to ship them to. Okay? And that's no smoke and mirrors. We, we got that happening every day. We're big in the wholesale used car market. And that's what we stress to you. If you want a new car, I'm not going to be beat because we all pay the same for them. Just give me the chance. It's going to come down to what they're giving you for yours. If you want a pre-owned car, same difference. Just give me the opportunity. That's all I'm asking for. So don't forget, go to markmartinautomotive.com. All of our lo locations are located there. We got Mark Martin Ford here. We got Mark Martin Kia next door. As I mentioned earlier, Mark Martin Chevrolet in Melbourne. Mark Martin Chevrolet Buick GMC's in Nash Flat. We got Mark Martin Finance Center in Highland. It's a buy here, pay here lot. We also have Mark Martin Finance Center right here in Southside, right down the road. So whatever your automotive needs are, we can take care of them. We also just started Mark Martin Power Sports. We bought a Honda store right up the road. So if you're into motorcycles, give us the opportunity. Just give one of our stores the opportunity to assist you, and we're going to take care of you. And I promise you this, they always told you that eggs are cheaper in the country. Just give me the chance. Eggs are always cheaper in the country.